Hi, I'm Belle from Seam Sew Me and I'm here at Quilt Week and I'm going to take just a moment to show you a quick tip that you might find helpful. It has to do with using a tailor's clapper, which I often use when I'm quilting. So today I taught a class in which we were sewing a lot of layers of fabric together, in which we're looking here at about four layers on each side. And so what I like to do with the tailor's clapper is when you press your seams open, because when you have certain blocks with a lot of layers, you're going to have bulk. And so you want to make sure you do press these open. I know it's a controversial topic, but when you do need to press open, you'll press, and I normally use a wool pressing mat, which the heat in there is extremely helpful to use with your tailor's clapper. And you'll just leave your tailor's clapper on there for just a few minutes. I'm going to show it to you without the tailor's clapper and show you the difference with getting flat seams. So we'll do this one really quickly. Leave that on there like so. There's that one. So you can see this one. You see it's not quite flat. Look how flat that one is. So that shows you the difference between a tailor's clapper using one and not using a tailor's clapper. So if you can get one of these, this one's personalized, but you can find one. Or you could use something else, another piece of wood, maybe from your shop you've got outside. Um, use a piece of wood and press that, and you will have much flatter seams, which is really helpful with putting your blocks together.